All right, thanks, Quentin. When people hear the words card skimmers, most people think of gas station card readers, but the reality is people can get your information from multiple sources, including your bank's ATM. That's what some area residents are finding out the hard way after a string of charges hit Columbus. Our Riley Livingston talks with law enforcement to bring us this story. The Columbus Police Department is on the lookout for the man seen in this video. Police Chief Fred Shelton says they suspect he is connected to a string of ATM card skimming reports across the city. In this case, we had this guy was going to ATM machines at banks in various locations in the city and just pulling up on a bicycle, taking a card out, inserting the card into the machine to obtain money from that personal account. And getting the information scammers need isn't as hard as people might think. So basically on, 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 the, on the credit card, there is this magnetic strip holds all your information. It, it holds all your transactions. And a person can take, they can take and get this information off this card and use this card on another card and just as, a, as we go and make a purchase, we just slide it. And all that information, all your routing information, your bank account, all, that, all this on the, it's right here contain this little magnetic strip. Chief Shelton says skimmers are also getting harder to spot, but there are some things you can do to stay financially secure. You need to check your bank account at least once a week. And if there are transactions that are, that are not authorized, you need to immediately notify your bank. The other thing is to take make sure that you cover your information. Someone may be behind you with, a, with an iPhone capture the card because all they really need is this number right here and they can take in charge and you can be buying a new house in Miami, Florida and not even know it. And while skimmers have become a growing concern, usually gas stations are where people look out for them. Never thought about that, but when I go, of course, to purchase gas, yes. I always check it to be sure if it, if it moved any, I would not use it. Banks are doing everything they can to keep scammers from stealing your information. The banks has, is being proactive. When you go and make an ATM transaction, there's a camera that's watching you. So the bank capture who, that person that's coming in, that's making that transaction, and it keeps a record. That was our Riley Livingston reporting. Now the chief says if something looks out of place, don't use the ATM, contact the bank or police to have them come out and investigate. And just one more footnote to this story, police wanted us to let you know that the bank ATM that you saw in the video, that surveillance video, is not the place where the skimming actually took place. So that's not where the information was gotten.